It has been three years, but I have made it back to the PCT. We are at Sonora Pass. We are hiking south to Lone Pine where I left off. There's our first PCT blaze. Blaze? Trail marker, I guess. Thoughts about your first mile in the Sierra? I love. It is 7 a.m. Uh, just packed up camp. Mims left about 30 minutes before I did, and we're starting the day with a climb, and then it's going to be pretty easy the rest of the day. And we're going to try to get to Dorothy Lake tonight because Dorothy Lake is supposed to be really nice for swimming, um, which means that we would be entering Yosemite tonight, which is pretty neat. Oh, there she is. If you look. Right there, you can see the top of Mims. She's just going over the pass, or the peak. We are, I am, over I think the top of the climb, and there's a downhill now, and I'm starting to see all the little lakes, which is awesome. The altitude is hitting me a bit, I think we're around like 10,000 feet, so after 16 hours in a car and not moving, I've been getting a little winded. I just watched two little bear cubs run up there. I heard something and I didn't know what it was. And there were two little bear cubs and I don't see the mom. And that's a little worrying. Oh, they were so cute. Day one. Two bear cubs. The smallest little cutest things. I'm gonna walk into a tree. They look so fluffy. Where are you? Hi! This is nice and shady. You'll never believe my morning. So there's PCT mile 1000. We are going to try to go, not try, we are going, uh, four more miles over Dorothy Lake Pass and then camping at Dorothy Lake. So we are, I am now, officially in Yosemite National Park. Uh, that was Dorothy Lake Pass, I'm assuming by the signs. 
So we're in Yosemite now. And this up here is Dorothy Lake. Out of all the lakes we passed today, this is the one that Mims wanted to go to. I've got about a mile left until I get to where I think we're going to be camping. To be fair, it is better than all the other lakes already. That's the Medberg Lake. It's taking me about six hours to do nine and a half miles, which makes me think I probably should have gotten in shape before coming out here. Um, there is a river stream, there's a stream halfway up that climb that I had been planning on refilling my water at. So I was drinking a bunch on the first half and all the gut hooks comments said the water was flowing. And I got there and it was dry, not even a drip. So I've been rationing, I've got about a sip left. Benson Peak right now. It is another two-mile climb. Last climb of the day, though. Um, we spent four hours at Smedbury Lake. We went out to an island in the middle of the lake and took a nap for like two hours. And then we met these four retired couples that were out there fishing and here on like a pack mule trip and they went swimming so we went swimming with them and next thing you know four hours went by
downhill for the rest of the day. Four and a half more miles. Got a deer right there. Another deer right there. Hold on, I just heard Mims. To do. I kept thinking this was about to end and it hasn't yet. All right, Mims with a good eyesight noticed that right back there is Twelme Falls. It's pretty neat. It's pretty neat. That's where we're gonna go for lunch, huh? You gonna go swimming? We're gonna rage. <laughs> Whoa! This one and the next one. There's two. So I think this is to that Glen 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 Allen. So we stopped for lunch at Tuolumne Falls and went skinny dipping. Well, Mims did. I was just on the shore, also naked. And no one was there. And then we turned around and there's like 20 people at the edge of the rocks taking photos of the falls. 
So, <laughs> sorry, mom. Okay, so that sign back there is where the PCT and the JMT meet.